hey guys welcome back to the channel oh my god it's been a while since i shared kiddies hairstyle on this channel i can't believe it while still waiting for adobe's hair to grow up so we can continue i decided to bring you all these two beautiful rubber band hairstyles that i made on her a long time ago they are so easy to make they are tension free so i bet you wouldn't want to miss this okay so stick around and let us dive right in as usual her hair has been washed and even moisturized but i also moisturize it yet again reason why it's looking all damp so i'll go ahead and start patting the hair i will start by patting from ear to ear then after which i will apply in some edge control to make the pattern more creeps and more visible then go back again with my preset comb was it the fire burning in me all of the noise So once I'm done patting that out, I'll go ahead and put the back into a bone, then start working with the front. For that, I will pat the front into three equal sizes, and in each of the parted sides, each of the parted hair, I will pat again. I will pat the middle, like divide it into two, like I'm doing now. I will apply some edge control to slick in the hair and to make the pattern more visible thereafter for each of the mini parted hair i will go ahead and divide into equal two parts like i am doing then apply some edge control to slick down the edges then tie with a rubber band yeah, I've been I will repeat the same process for this other side in this section. Divide into two equal parts, slick down with some edge control, and then tie with a rubber band. Since this is a crisscross rubber band hairstyle, I'll go ahead and take this side to this other side. Just watch how I'm doing this because I can't describe it. So just see for yourself. So I'm done with the first row. Next, I'll move on to the second row, which is the middle. Health was almost crying because she was feeling sleepy and I wasn't allowing her to do her thing. So I just had to, you know, put her head on my thighs so she can relax and sleep. So back to the hair. Guys, I'd advise you section out the three rows in the front before you start styling so the sectionings can be equal repeating the same process from earlier i'll part the middle then part each of the mini sectioning into three unlike two that i did on the other side since this middle one is like deeper to the back i don't know if you get me now i'm done styling the front so it's time to move to the back there isn't a lot to do here as you can see i'll just comb back her hair then put into a rubber band okay and after which i'll go ahead and you know braid you don't necessarily have to 
braid if you don't know how to braid you can just twist it wrap around and tie with a rubber band so after i'm done braiding to the, to the tip i'll go ahead and wrap it around the root then tie with a rubber band Sophia, in a lot of ways she's not near so I have this leftover crochet locks. I'll go ahead and start putting it onto her hair with my crochet pin. I will pass my crochet pin through her hair, then put on the loop of the crochet lock onto the hook of the crochet pin, cover it up, then pull out and then pass the end of the crochet lock through the loop and you know, just like I'm doing. I will continue with the method, I will continue with the whole process till i feel like it's full enough okay i'll go ahead and trim off the ends with a pair of scissors so it won't be too long for her since she's a toddler and i forgot to mention i took about two strands of the crocheted extension to wrap around the roots of the hair you know just to secure everything i will apply my mousse to give it some extra shine and to firm it up and of course not forgetting my accessories i started to use this orange bow tie but my daughter insisted on the blue one which you can see that tiny blue one over there anyway see how beautiful this hairstyle looks on her and she absolutely love it, it would be a pain, love moving on to the second hairstyle let us dive right in
If you want to see the individual video of these hairstyles that I put together making one, I have like separate video for each of them. If you want to see that, check the link in my description box. I have the links in my description box. Those videos are kind of longer and you know they are way more detailed than these. This is actually detailed, but those ones are way more detailed since they are you know longer. So check in my description box, the videos are there. and we are done i want you guys to leave a comment below which one do you prefer between these two rubber band hairstyles for me i think i prefer the second one more but let me know which you prefer see how my baby is glowing like and she love it of course she always loved the outcome of her hairstyles even though she doesn't enjoy the process a lot i mean who does who enjoy the process of hairstyle <laughs> anyway if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do that right away thumbs up to this video share if you can and see you in my next one bye bye i love you still and you know i always will till the end of time i won't change my mind